Is the Chengdu J-10 fighter an exact replica of the Israeli-made Lavi fighter jet? What are the technical characteristics of this aircraft? In this video, I will talk about Chengdu J-10, China's first original production fourth-generation fighter aircraft. In the 1980s, the Beijing administration knew that the Chinese Air Force was lagging behind compared to other countries. The Soviet Union had developed modern warplanes such as the Su-27 and MiG-29. America was also taking warplanes such as F-14, F-15, F-16, and F-18 into its inventory. China's arch-rival India and Taiwan were also adding new generation aircraft and ammunition to their inventories. China's inventory had clones of old generation Soviet warplanes such as the J-6 and J-7. China was far behind both in terms of warplanes and the ammunition used by these planes, and a new generation warplane was needed for China. In 1980, Pakistan and Israel contributed to develop a new fighter aircraft for China. Pakistan was an ally of China in those years as it is today. Pakistan was buying F-16 fighter jets from the USA in those years, and China asked Pakistan for permission to inspect these planes. Pakistan also accepted this offer and allowed Chinese engineers to examine the F-16. Chinese engineers learned a lot about the aerodynamics of the aircraft, but their main interest was fly-by-wire technology. China learned a lot about this technology, and they transferred the same technology to the J-10. Another country that supported China for the J-10 was Israel. Israel was developing a new attack aircraft called LAVI in the 1980s, but when the American government prevented the development of this project in 1987, according to some claims, the Israeli government sold the information they obtained from this project to China. But the Israeli government denies these allegations. In 1988, the Chinese government officially started the Chengdu J-10 program. With the help of Israel and Pakistan, the project progressed rapidly and the first prototype appeared in 1996. The first prototype and today's J-10s have nothing to do with it because the first prototype had a terrible accident in 1997 and the pilot died. After the accident, the engineers realized that the fly-by-wire technology on the plane had serious faults and they rebuilt all the control systems on the plane. In 1998, a new prototype of the J-10 was developed and successfully made its maiden flight. Serial production of J-10, which was taken into inventory in 2005, started in 2014. When China realized that it could not develop an engine with sufficient technology for this aircraft, it asked for help from Russia. China would not normally ask for help from Russia, but the Cold War ended, the Soviet Union dissolved, and the Russian Federation, struggling with the economic crisis, remained from the Soviets. While the Russian Federation struggled with the economic crisis, it did not reject China's request for radar and engine. China used Russian-made AL-31 aircraft engine in J-10 fighter planes, but in the following years they started to use domestically produced WZ-10 engines. J-10 warplanes are not the most advanced warplanes in China's inventory, but these planes are the apple of China's eyes. Now, if you want, let me talk about the technical features of this aircraft. We can say that the f 16 equivalent of the fighter plane in the Eastern Bloc is the J-10. Although the Chinese compare this aircraft with the Eurofighter or Rafale fighter aircraft, in fact, the equivalent of the J-10 is the F-16. Both the physical characteristics and the performance of the J-10 are very similar to the F-16. The Chengdu J-10 fighter jet has a length of 16.3 meters, a wingspan of 9.8 meters, and a height of 5.7 meters. Curb weight of this aircraft is 9,750 tons and maximum takeoff weight is 21,000 tons. J-10 aircraft are single seat, only the training versions are double seated. In the first versions of the J-10, Russian production Saturn AL-31 engines were used, but today, domestic production WS-10 engines are used in these planes in China. Thanks to its single engine, the J-10 fighter jet reaches a speed of 2,305 km per hour. 
The combat radius of the J-10 is 900 kilometers, its maximum range is 3,200 kilometers, and it can reach a maximum altitude of 17,000 meters. The main weapon of the J-10, the Grazev Shipunov GSH-23, has a total of 11 ammunition slots on the fuselage and under the wings. It can carry a total of 5,600 kilograms of ammunition in these ammunition slots. The J-10 is the first Chinese-made aircraft with fly-by-wire technology and has a four-channel cable flight system. The J-10 has stability problems just like the F-16, but thanks to the flight computer, it can fly as if there is no problem. Thanks for watching.